Here we are at the video, or at the ice fishing shack, Lake of the Woods, first week of March 2009. Okay, now we're going to go in the shack. Here's our our two uh, gentlemen that took care of us for the weekend. Uh, they are uh, lovers. Uh, we don't like to talk about that though because they're bigger than we are. But you're looking good too, big boy. <laughs> Okay, let's go in the fish house here. Yeah, let's see what we got here. This is a this is a six bunk cabin style fish house. And here here we got Gordy. He's the youngster of the bunch. And also the one that's caught the most fish, believe it or not. I don't know how the hell that happened. We taught him everything we know about fishing and he still doesn't know anything. But anyway, we're going to pan around the interior of this fine specimen of a fish house. And you'll see uh, there's Jim Jorgensen over there. He's from Faribault. And uh, Jerry Jarvis. Jerry, you want to say hello? Want to move the camera or anything? Okay. Jerry, he's been trying pretty hard this weekend, but he hasn't caught shit. Anyway, uh, as we turn around here, these are the bunks, and you'll see that it's pretty, uh, pretty tight uh, accommodations for people to sleep in there. If you sleep in the top bunk, you roast like a nut in the oven. In the middle bunk, it's colder than you know what. In the bottom bunk, that's uh, Iceberg Manor down there. Here Gordy is getting some coffee in our brand new coffee pot. The first eight pots we cooked out of there were awful, most worst coffee ever. We thought Jimmy was lake water for the coffee. But anyway, here's Jerry. He's he's uh, the camp cook today. As you can see, it's first class uh, kitchen space here. Uh, we got a it features a window tucked above the oven. Uh, you can't really see what the hell you're doing even with the window. There's no light. But uh, look at look at this situation here. There's not even room for a mouse to run around in here. Of course, we killed the mouse the first day we were here. But you can see here on the on the counter we do have some peanut butter and and yeah, that's Dorothy's flipper right there. And I will bring it home. And we've got some club crackers. Oh, what have we got here? Ooh, Smoky Joe's. Joe's look pretty good. Anyway, here's the pee bucket. This is what we're supposed to pee in, but some people, you know, they got to pee in the minnows. And uh, in the middle of the night, both buckets look quite alike. Oh, yeah. I will go to the bathroom in a second. This furnace here only has one setting, and it's very hot. Okay, let's let's go to the other amenity featured in this video brochure I'm doing for this is what affectionately is called the crapper. See that white bucket there? You can't crap in the bucket. You got to put a white bag in there, and you crap in the bag and tie it off and throw it in the snowbank. And then that big fat guy that you saw earlier in the video, he runs around and picks up people's crap all day in the bags. Jerry, is there anything you want to say about uh, this wonderful weekend shared in this fish house? Really. Let's see here. Come on. No. Don't be bashful. I've got some words of wisdom. Jerry? No. Okay. Let's go to the youngest member of our fishing crew here, Gordy. I'm going to pass on some of the fishing tips I've learned this weekend. Okay. Mm -hmm. A few fishing tips. One, don't horse them. <laughs> Two, if he wants to run, let him run. Just to be more specific. Well, I don't really know what they mean, but whenever you got a fish on the line, you're supposed to say those. Would you like to talk about how many walleyes you caught this week in, in comparison to the rest of us? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It wasn't very close this weekend. Yeah. I'll fish them all. Yeah. What's your secret? Uh, ignorance. Ignorance. Ignorance is bliss, he says. Okay, uh, okay. Let's go on over here to Jimmy Joe Jorgensen. And yes, that is his real name. Jim, would you like to talk about your grand entrance into the fish house initially? <laughs> when you first walked in the fish house on Friday afternoon? 
In your words, what happened? <laughs> Go ahead. You think you fell down the big hole. There you, <laughs> you fell in the church hole. Did it interrupt what you were saying in mid sentence? No. Yeah, I kept around on duck and like. Okay, <laughs> like nothing happened. Okay, uh, how did you do fishing this weekend? Not, not as quite as well as the rest. I, I was, I uh, somehow wasn't my day. Wasn't yeah. my weekend. Okay. <laughs> okay. Well, better luck how next many? year. <laughs> how many daughters? How many daughters did you get? I'll be on the stringer. Zero. <laughs> okay. Any parting words? Any parting comments? No. I can't. Okay, if you come up with any smart words, let me know. Gordy, get a view of uh, what Jim oh, yeah. does with the fish. Okay. <laughs> All right. See here. When Jim catches his fish, they wind up laying in the hole, just like that. And uh, you know, Jim being Norwegian and all that, will be pickled herring. Yeah. Either that, or he'll uh, he'll put acid with it and make wood fish. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, anyway, uh, that's how they make it. That pretty much uh, is the short and sweet of it for this trip here. Jerry, would you like to say a few words? Nope. Okay, well, thank, thank you all for contributing to our yeah. fishing video here. And uh, thank you to all of our wives and loved ones that that contributed to the financially or otherwise to this wonderful trip. And uh, Anyway, uh, bye-bye.